Hi everybody, my name is Zach and this is Zach Does All The Things. Today we're doing the written word, which means we're gonna look at some more poetry. Last week I did a villanelle and I was possibly gonna do a haiku, but I found another variation which I think is just as cool. It's called a tonka. If you know anything about haikus, you know that they're three lines. It's five syllables, then seven syllables, then five syllables again. With the tonka, it's basically the same, but instead of being very short, it's only kind of short. It's five lines with five syllables, seven syllables, five syllables again, and then the last two are seven. Just like a haiku, they generally have something to do with nature, so I got all my forest friends, my moose, my bear, and whatever he is, and we're gonna try to make a tonka. All right, so I've got my pad, and I've got my pencil, and it's time to write a tonka. I laid it out for myself. We got five, seven, five, seven, seven, and it's gonna be about nature, 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 nature. So this is a very short poem form. It's definitely challenging just as it is and totally worth it to just do a regular tonka without having to up the stakes, but I wanna try something that'll really push my creativity, so I'm gonna make sure that I mention a few words. Moose, bear, a new friend. Because I gotta be honest, he's cute, but I really have no idea what he is. Back to our tonka. Let's see, first line, a moose and a bear. No, too simple. Two forest friends, no. A tree falls, no. Out in the forest, okay, out in the forest. All right, so I've got my first two lines. Out in the forest, the moose and the bear stand still. That says bear. I swear. It's out in the forest, the moose and the bear stand still. Okay. Enemies by birth. Yeah. Seven more and seven more. Okay. Hey, look, we made a haiku. Now we gotta keep moving on. All right, so I'll work backwards. I know a new friend is three. One, two, three. So we'll put that at the end somewhere. And then I want this at the end to say somehow they made a new friend, I guess. Somehow. They made a new friend. Okay. Out in the forest, the moose and the bear stand still. Enemies by birth. Somehow they make a new friend. A rustle. Okay, so that's three. A rustle. One, two, three. A start. That's five. Out in the forest, the moose and the bear stand still. Enemies at birth. A rustle, a start. Both look, somehow, they make a new friend. I think I wrote a tonka. Here it is, one more time. My tonka. Out in the forest, the moose and the bear stand still, enemies by birth. A rustle, a start, both look, somehow, they make a new friend. But who's the friend? I mean, I don't know if it's poignant, but it is a nice story about this one and this one meeting that guy and uh, making a new friend. So that's cute. And that's the sort of stuff you can do with the Tonka. I mean, it doesn't have to be serious. It's just about observing the world that you're in and trying to express some appreciation for it. So go try it on your own. It's just five, seven, five, seven, seven. Share them with me if you want. I'm sure there's some better poets out there than I, but try it out. Thanks everybody. This has been Zach Does All The Things. Tomorrow we're doing arts and crafts, so I'm bringing my friend Adam on to do more origami. Apparently he's pretty good, and he has some things he wants to teach me, so see you then.